Okay, girls. So here now, grade six girls, you if you want this is an activity or a project, and you can make a DNA model. See this one. You need hey, scissor, sketch pen or pencil, straw, four different colors, four long sticks, black tape. Scale. Thermicol. Cut the straw in small pieces each of 6 centimeters. There should be 11 pieces of straw of each color, total 44. And if you feel this is tough, because each one now you have to put a join two different color straw. If you feel this is tough, you can go with the other one. Which one, Miss? Even this one is just type DNA model using straws and you can make it. Miss, it's really hard. It's hard for you? Okay. You can make this. No, miss, it's My dear, you can In make this. In this video, I'm going to show you an easy way to make a model of DNA. It's not 3D. Very just with the too. help of. Uh, just use a couple of household items here. A bunch of Q-tips that you can see there. I picked out. Can you see this? That is markers, A codeine, T thymine, to code each T thiazosin and T guanine. Yeah, four sketch pens. Sequence. That is pink, and then green, I'm also going to use blue, and the other one. So that just so you right now what I'm doing in the video is I'm just coding. Can you do this one at least? Coloring, I should say, my Q-tips. Miss, I didn't yeah. understand what is the vast like. Match up those four different. My dear, it's a model bases. of DNA. Adenine, thymine. Okay, then we would color this one, and then what we should do? Why you are coloring? coloring because it will show the difference between the four bases. That is adenine. Yeah, yeah. After we color, what we should do? Believe it or not, I've got this entire project. You see how he Same, same way. That's why I'm showing the video. One minute, yeah. Let me move this. Right now, it's nice, I'm Miss. Coding. It's a nice project. It's easier. Um, now you'll I never have forget. All my Q-tips laid out, and I actually figured out how to lay See? them out. How you to remember what did I say? You the basis code A T, adenine and thymine. Yeah. Pink and pink and green together. See, pink and green together, and then you have cytosine, mm -hmm. guanine. <laughs> based on that picture that you see on the computer right there. So I just kind of matched up that to the picture that was on the computer. Now I take my duct tape. Why do you put that? I lay it out. Because no, Miss, I think that one was uh, not a nice. End of the duct tape. Because see, there were two papers. There were two white papers. You see how he did it. Do the same Very thing easy, the This side. is not at all tough. Then I'm almost done. All I yeah. have to do is trim off the ends. Miss, okay, how I'm sorry, girls. I'm sorry. Break from, uh, this make model. my double helix. And, uh, In less than 35 minutes, I'm done with my model. Can you see this? Within half an hour, he yeah. the model. Oh, Miss, nice. Is it easy, uh, uh, Vatin? Yes, Miss, wait a minute. Just wait a minute. I will send you in the group the video of this. Yeah. Okay? And then, yeah. girls, even while making, take some pictures so that later you compile the pictures and you show your work. That's what your own work. That's no none of YouTube or something. That's your own work made by Watin, made by Lean, and made by Malak. And you can explain about yes. it a little bit. I should bring from this one. 
Yeah, yeah, from this one, same. And then just take the mark yeah, and color it. And then color it with the pink and uh, blue. No, see, uh, not important that it has to be pink and blue. Only thing, whatever colors you are using, it must not be same. And you must write on the top that A is timing, understood? Yeah, and then how I will bring like, um, he, he just put it in something. I didn't understand it. What is this? Uh, one second, I will show you again. Uh, paper. See, he took, he took two, paper. Yeah, he took two white papers. One minute here. He took two white papers. It was DNA model, right? DNA model. Using straws. Yeah. See, this one. What did he do was, he took- In this video, I'm gonna show you. Can you hear it? Can you hear the warm sound? Yeah. yeah. And then I'm also going to use a little bit of duct See? tape. He just colored right everything and first kept the side. Okay, after finishing everything. Yeah, See, after finishing everything, uh, then he took to two finish. white papers. He kept them side by side. See? Um, he kept two white papers side by side. Okay? This is some other A4? Pen. A4 paper. Yes, simple A4 paper. He... He kept, but put it on the landslide, Yanni. Don't put it uh, horizontal, sleeping, like sleeping paper. And then put all those, and then take a tape and attach those two papers. Yeah, but I didn't understand. How did he attach the tape? From see, see here. Out, see, these two he kept out. side by How side. He put all of these uh, straws, sorry, not straws, the cotton buds. The right there. And then. So I just kind of matched up that. He took a tape. To the picture that was How on he the computer. does it. He took a tape. I take my duct tape. Duct tape. He put and I lay it out on the paper first, and he stick. Start attaching those Q-tips to that end of the duct See what tape. He, oh, he put it down. yeah, yeah. He put it upside down. The sticky, the sticky sign was up, and then he put those co cotton buds on that. So it stick to the so tape, to get from and then this. he folded it. How much it. I have to get from this? Yes. How much I have to get from this? How? Maybe two. How much? How many? You count these. How many they said? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 20, 21. Okay, so I have 21. to get um, 21 and yes. then take a paper. Okay, it's easy. It's easy. You can do it. Can I see the video? It's not even expensive. It's not something so expensive or something which is not easily available. Everyone yeah. has cotton buds at home. Yeah, Everyone has two papers and a tight tape. Yeah. yeah. It over, sealed up. See how he folded? It's very simple. The same he folded thing on it. the other side. And then again, the other, the other side, same Then thing. I'm almost done. He folded it. All I have to do is trim off the ends, give a little twist to make my double Nothing. He, he did not do anything with the paper down. With my model. Yeah, nice, it's really nice. Very interesting and excellent. You will do it definitely, inshallah. Uh, you can uh, do it till Sunday if you don't. Face masks. Can... You will do it, inshallah. You can take time, my dear girls. No problem. I will give you five marks for the project. No, I, I will give you five marks for the project of the term two. I mean, sorry, quarter two. Okay? Thanks. Okay, Mr. Now coming to our biotechnology. This is something you will remember more about DNA in your life. When you do something with your hand, you feel happy to do it. Okay. Yesterday, I told you about cloning. We studied about ge genetic engineering. And we, I also have shown you about cloning. You remember? How they do yeah. cloning, they replace the DNA. Okay. I'm sorry, guys. No problem, miss. It's okay. How does biotechnology... Wait a second. How does biotechnology impact our world? Scientists are aware that there are many ethical, legal, and social issues that arise from the ability to use and change living things. 
biotechnology can impact both our society and environment. Girls, I'm saying you this very clearly. We have many genetic disorders, which still the scientists are working and they'll want to fix it, fix the problem, but they cannot. So they are, they are trying different ways, even today, that how can they fix that problem? I will show you some examples <coughs> that show some concerns that might be raised during a classroom debate about biotechnology. This is the larva of genetically engineered mosquito. This is a larva of a mosquito, okay? Mosquito, its DNA includes a gene from a glowing jellyfish. Okay. They made this mosquito. Hmm, tell me. What is it green? Listen to me, that's what? It's like artificial selection or artificial breeding. What they did, what people did was, what the scientists did was, he took a gene from glowing jellyfish that causes the mosquito to glow. You know, when the mosquito is a lava, it's a very first stage, it's green in color and it's just like this. But why is it glowing and showing that gl glowing green color? Because they took a gene from that glowing fish and they put that gene inside the mosquito's body. SubhanAllah. And the mosquito usually doesn't grow in, I'm glowing green color, but it is glowing here. It is thought that the DNA of the mosquito could be changed so that the mosquito could not spread malaria. They did this so that it do not spread malaria. It is thought that the DNA of mosquito could be changed they want to take out that DNA from the mosquito that actually causes malaria in people. If the mosquito could be engineered so that it does not spread malaria, many lives could be saved. This is what the scientists thought. What mosquitoes are food source for birds and fish? Are there health risks to animals that eat genetically modified mosquitoes? Now the question comes. When I try to modify this mosquito and this mosquito is eaten up by the prey, maybe maybe it's because it's a food for many animals like birds and fishes. If they eat this mosquito, what will happen to them? This mosquito where I change the DNA. Of course, it is risky, my dear. It's not good for someone to have, like example, today, your father gets chicken at home to cook. Are we eating good healthy chicken? No. No. You know, the chicken which we eat are boiled. Yes, I didn't understand that for the mos mo mosquito. Mosquito, simple. Yeah, uh, Mateen. A mosquito causes a disease called as malaria. Okay? Okay. So, so what malaria. they find that which DNA is causing malaria. That DNA, they take out from the from that mosquito and put a different DNA. Like example, in this picture, they put a DNA of, they put a DNA of uh, what do you call as? Jellyfish. Jellyfish, a glowing jellyfish. So the mosquitoes malarial DNA is taken off. And instead of that, I put a jelly glowing fish DNA and that glows. I know it's, it's, it's now useful for us that the, if the malaria bites me, nothing will happen to me. I'm sorry, if the mosquito causing malaria bites me, nothing will happen. But what if that mosquito is eaten up by the, their prey, that's fishes and uh, other animals? Of course, it's not good to eat some modified yeah. genetical things. Example, I gave you an example. Nowadays, what chicken we eat is not the breeded chicken, is it a hype? It's not like, it's not a natural chicken, which is daily, uh, you know, uh, uh, moving around and uh, enjoying its life, eating what it wants. And yeah. then, then we are taking that fresh chicken. No, they just take those eggs artificially. They let them grow in six months, imagine girls. Sometime in few days. What? Yes, I will show you a video if I can. You give me a minute. So Commercially broiler chicken farming is a profitable business. Keeping broiler chickens, the what? farmers sometimes what? face various problems. If you cannot yes, overcome so these problems in time, you have to face losses. One, one As a farm owner, 
keeping what is it like there's so many chicken in one place yeah. like if they want to yeah, get I'm one chicken much. all of the chickens is going to be afraid and my dear they quickly they don't take one chicken at at you know because it's like a key chicken or they take together and they خلاص they it's very disturbing girls to know the reality that chickens are not the natural grown one they they inject in the pies and that's why you know today we have so many issues for hormones you know that we have so many hormonal issues why yeah yeah because we are not eating something natural those yeah, are there's so many changed by also. some injection they put steroids so that it grows fast and it becomes so big it becomes fast yeah it comes to us and we feel wow it's yummy and that's why they say eat vegetables okay that's once right. a week two times a week chicken okay but you know that here especially in saudi arabia we eat it daily yeah and if we don't yeah. get chicken if we don't get chicken we will be angry to our mom mama what is this i don't want vegetables yeah. i know okay. that because <laughs> because my own kids they say mama there is no kuku they say you know the my little one he calls kuku mama there yeah i was saying kuku also yeah no kuku i will not eat oh my god do you know the reality That's yeah, yeah. table say mama we will eat only chicken twice a week we will eat vegetables we will you know if vegetables are tasty if they are making a good style they are tasty if you put good yeah. that and you know it just tasty yeah better to yeah, if you put like broccoli cucumber with the yogurt it's going to be tasty yes cucumber yeah, so very anyways broccoli. let's see Do you want to see this video or shall I start with the lesson continue with the lesson No problem Let's see the video The broiler chicken all the things to remember let's know The house must be cleaned well before the chicken piglets arrives Then the house will be free from the germ of 7 2 10 days Then the litter should be spread in the house 6 hours before the arrival of the chicken piglets The brooder ring should be prepared. Miss they take the, the side with their hands. Bring the temperature to 33 to 35 degrees Celsius. The brooder house can be heated before 12 to 24 hours in the very winter. Within the brooder, one day's child food and water pot should be placed. If needed, glucose mixture water can be given for chicken piglets. For the first one Too. what are they giving they are giving glucose water so that you know they become fat very quickly yeah that is what should they die they don't die no no see 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 them two hours children have to take time to rest and give time to eat water and food after one two two hours food water supply and temperature should be checked and corrected if necessary the temperature inside the brooder will be first 3 days 33 degrees celsius 3 to 7 days 30 to 31 degrees celsius and 7 to 14 days to keep the temperature at 26 to 28 celsius after 14 days no heat is needed in the summer however in winter the temperature is below 20 degrees celsius will give heat regular food and water will be supplied daily If the litter is more humid, then it will have to sprinkle wooden crusts or husk on it. Every day, light will be supplied for 23 hours. What artificial do they do? light. They apply lots of artificial light, my dear, artificial not sunlight. So that they become big very fast and see how it becomes very big fast. Thing should be provided after sunset. It is best to put the temperature in the broiler chicken room at 18 to 22 degrees Celsius. In summer, electric fan must be used. To prevent disease, vaccination should be done periodically. At the age of 1 to 7 days, Ranocet vaccine will be given. Gumbro's vaccine will be given at 7 to 10 days. Gamero vaccine boost in the plat one meal plate. At the time of brooding, a water pot should be brooding up to 5 chicken piglets can be brooded Every square meter and in the second week 30 to 35 chicken piglets per square meter will be brooding sheik guard circumference should be increased by a small amount daily the height of the chick guard is 18 to 20 inches 
temperatures can be reduced, or increased by decreasing, or increasing the height of hover. Again, temperatures can be controlled by increasing, or decreasing the number of electric lights, or what? In the slightest neglect of the farmer, there can be many problems in the broiler farm. Use separate shoes inside the farm, so that the disease from the outside, cannot enter the farm. They take care Due to of this. Yani, things that... Anyways... Girls, this is what for today. Tomorrow, inshallah, Sunday, I'll continue with it, okay? So they take the mist, they take the chicken, and they, and they put it in the heat. They, and they are and showing some of the other country. I think it's some Bangladesh or some other country. But here, here girls, everything is elect with the electrical things. No, nobody has to be there a lot. They just have to monitor. But they have artificial lights and everything here. Okay, anyways, take care, girls. Have a nice day and have a nice weekend. It was, uh, I enjoyed uh, watching you all today. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you.